would you like to work for a nationally recognized company that pays well and promises an exciting career? My second day on the job, phone call came in about 2.30 in the morning. I leaned over and I looked at my wife and I told her, I guess this is what the job is all about. You never know what to expect. You get a call and you show up and there's either a pole got knocked down or a transformer blew up, all kind of different stuff and you never know what's going to happen and that's, that's a real exciting part of it. We're talking about line work for Austin Energy, the ninth largest public power utility in America. Line workers are the face of Austin Energy, the people who maintain Austin's electrical system 24-7. From new residential installations to downed power lines after a storm, this is the group that keeps the lights on in our neighborhoods and businesses. Energy, electricity. Sometimes people might forget what this invention is because all it is is just a light switch to many people on the wall. But there's a whole world going on behind that wall, up to a pole, all the way down to the substation. There's many things that happen along that, and that's what I do. In Austin, there are approximately 10,000 miles of power lines, 140,000 utility poles, and some 40,000 transformers that need servicing. 30 years later, you could be driving down the road and uh, look up at that same pole and just know, hey, I was the one that put that cross arm up or I tied in that wire myself. You know, it's just a great feeling. Austin Energy offers one of the best line worker training programs in the state, if not the country. It has a lot to do with mental aptitude. Mentally, can you really grasp what you need to do? Do you really want to do this? If the answer is yes, then consider applying for an entry-level helper position with Austin Energy. We're always looking for new employees to start in bottom level and work their way up. Austin Energy's training program is four years long and is designed to help employees advance their careers. In fact, promotions are built into the program and pay raises are almost guaranteed. Gentlemen, how do we ground a single phase transformer according to our uh, DCS manual? In addition to the classroom, training also occurs in the field. Coming from high school, you're gonna feel right at home. You're gonna stick you behind a desk and you're gonna start learning things off paper. So what's your question for as far as capacitors go, Robert? And then guess what, right after you do that on paper, you're gonna go outside and you're gonna climb a pole. Pole climbing is one of the first skills that all new line workers must master. They're going to teach you just like on how they taught you how to walk, just a little different, going vertical, because that's where your office is going to be at. The longest I've ever been up on a pole, I would have to say, uh, when we just got on the training crew, was about five hours. The more times you do it, the more times you get comfortable with it, you get more comfortable with your equipment, and you just have an overall confidence about your job. There are two main training facilities at Austin Energy, each equipped with utility poles to simulate the real thing. We're going to simulate that this is going to be a single phase primary down. Helpers work under the direct supervision of veteran line workers. Under direct supervision, you know, we can have our ones start working on energized secondary. This is all part of the on-the-job training. They learn to prepare electrical equipment load materials, and drive large commercial vehicles like bucket trucks. A work crew typically consists of a crew leader, a journeyman lineman, an apprentice, and a helper. I feel like I'm working with the legends of this profession. These guys have been around for a while, and I don't want to feel like I'm putting an age on them, but they know what they know, and they've been in many experiences that I'm just now encountering for the first time. Helpers must prove they can think and act quickly during emergency situations and have the desire to work outdoors, even in the most extreme weather conditions. All of our crew leads and the guys that complete these jobs love individuals who are hard workers, who are self-motivated. Each employee is given the opportunity to learn the skills they need so that they can progress through their apprenticeship and eventually make it to a distribution electrician three, which is what we consider a journeyman level lineman. Teamwork is valued at a very high level. Working around energized power lines can be hazardous, so it's important to know and trust your fellow employees. You have to build confidence with your teammates so they'll know that when they're up on the pole, when something goes wrong, that you have their back. Basically what that means is my life's in your hands, your life's in mine. We have fun even though it's a very serious job. I mean, we all get along. A lot of us hang out outside of work. It's definitely a team environment. Austin Energy. 
And for those with a competitive edge, the annual Lineman's Rodeo is a fun way to see how line workers rank among their peers. Each year, Austin Energy crews get a chance to prove just how good they are by competing in a series of line work events. Appreciate your help, we really do. Austin Energy line work is a unique career that provides great job security and excellent employee benefits. I was in the military, worked in restaurants, worked in construction, and it's the best job I've ever had. Coming up on it. I'm grateful for the opportunity to work in here with Austin Energy. I take real pride in what I do. If you love an interesting job that's going to make a real decent living, it's always a new experience just about every day. If you're that type of person who likes that adventure, this is one of those jobs for you. So if you want to be part of a great team and work for an outstanding company, join Austin Energy today.